this is the ugliest thing you guys are probably gonna see today. You know what I looked like? Kevin. Is that his name from Spongebob that got stung by a jellyfish? Top of the morning to ya. I'm here with my boyfriend that doesn't cheat on me. And today we, we are going to laser away to get my lips done. And if you guys didn't know, I already have my lips done. I got half a syringe and I never went to go get them like touched up or use my other half a syringe. So I'm gonna go in and get a new syringe. I'll probably still do half, but I'm gonna touch it up. Ask yeah. him if they wanna order his wig. Does anybody <laughs> wanna buy the wig that Martin used in my last video? Martin pulled a cheating prank on me better. yesterday. Is I didn't realize that you had gotten home when you had gotten home, cause it was just, it happened so fast. Yeah. And I didn't, Isaiah was charging his phone because his phone was dead because we wanted to get another angle. And then your camera was dead. Or actually the, the SD card was full. Oh. And my phone was the only angle that I could get. Last time I got my lips done, I went by myself. All my friends were busy, Martin was working. And I didn't get numbing, which was like the biggest mistake. I really like my lips now. I think they're beautiful. I think she did an amazing job, even though people were like, Fix your lips, they're uneven, whatever. My lips are pretty even now, huh? Yeah, like that. Yeah, when but I first got it done, when it was swollen and healing, it was kind of like all fucked up, but that's But like the when you look at somebody, process. you never even think that. You never, like, yeah. oh, your lips are uneven. Or even just saying that in yeah, general. Like, Shut, Shut up. up. Don't be rude. I have to take my makeup off. And I forgot to pack my foundation for after, so I'm gonna look stupid. Oh, my pimple. Uh, we have hazelnut, French vanilla, and half and half. What would you like? Uh, vanilla, the French vanilla. Bye. Yeah. Her? I know that I still love her. Oh, thanks for letting me know that. Where do they put it, the numbing in? They put the numbing in all over. It's like a cream. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's a cream. You look like Martin's gonna get his lips done next. Yes. No, I wouldn't do it. Thumbs this video up if you want Martin's to get his lips done. I definitely wanna do that. I'm gonna put um, BLT on you. Okay. Which is our strongest numbing cream. So you're gonna feel it like almost immediately. Ready? Open your mouth a little bit. Can you feel it? Mm -mm. No? Yeah. Actually, yeah, on this side. Yeah, right? I told yeah. you, you feel it like right away. It's super strong. All right, let me go get your boyfriend. Thanks. This is what the room looks like. Cute, cute, cute. Cute TV. It's always so cozy. Gigi Hadid. Oh, she wasn't lying. I do feel the numbing already. Will you record oh. when she's doing it? Can I get some numb? No, I don't want it. You don't want some? No. It feels it feels good. Do it. Don't get it in your mouth though. like yeah. Just put it on the outside. It feels pretty good. We have to go to a lunch right after this. I'm gonna be looking crazy. Ew. <laughs> We're doing it. I'm gonna wipe this all off okay. first. Can I lay back? Then? Yeah, of course. Um, no new medications or anything. You're not on any blood thinners. No. You're not pregnant or breastfeeding. Oh, it feels so weird. It's strange, oh. right? <laughs> Is it on your tongue? You look tip a little bit. So what do you want to do today? Okay, so. You ready? No. <laughs> <laughs> yes. oh, oh. That perfect. Well, you just kind of yes. tell me when you're about to put it in. Then. Yeah, so. absolutely. Of course, sometimes we turn your head a little bit this way. Okay. That's not much cooler. Hold on, I didn't feel it at all. So I'm going to do a little bit more space it up. Are you excited to start Doing great. 
Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> of the syringe. So do you want to add more to the top lip or would you like to start now on the um, bottom? If we start with the bottom, can we go back and forth? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. Of course. Can we start with the bottom? Okay, and perfect. See. Yeah. And you just want overall volume for the bottom? Yeah. If you put <laughs> it... the bottom one feeling? <laughs> it hurts a little more than top, but it's okay. Really? I feel like every time I get my lips done, it's like the top always hurts me so much more. Really? Yeah. I don't know oh, why. I can just feel it. It doesn't hurt. I can just feel it. Just more. feel it more? Yeah. Are you trying to get the balloon in there? Yeah. <laughs> so that's just a few more. I don't know if I should do the bottom look bigger. A little bit more of like a little pout area. I can like kind yeah. of. Cool. Yeah. I can like kind of see it, but I like can't see it. I love this size, and when I did it the first time, it swelled, and then when it It'll stopped, it went way So it down. is a little swollen right now. Okay. So if you want me to add a tiny bit more to the top, and then we'll be done. Yeah, let's do a little bit more so that awesome. when it goes so that down, it's not it as small. Yeah. Are there any lip exercises that she should be doing after this? No, absolutely. <laughs> You're trying to actually limit your mouth movements and activities for the next 12 hours. Massage it all out really quick. Nice to meet you guys. <laughs> nice to meet you guys as well. Are y'all not like numb right now? So it's like kind of hard to yeah, talk, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Is this what you expected? Me? I was like, what? I was Never like seen when it I went the first time by yeah. myself. No, yeah. I didn't know what you were going through. I'm gonna send you home with um, an ice pack right now as well that you can put on there. I love when they look all nice and plump. That's me. I think it completes my. This is what I look like behind the camera at all times. <laughs> no big deal. Do you love my lips? They look so yeah. good. Lips, oh, my God. I was like, I really want them to look like this when they're done swelling. So put more in there. <laughs> Yeah. Come spank me. Come spank me. I'm gonna be jealous. They look pretty big. We're on the way to. I wanted to film the drive because it's just so pretty here. I always wanted to go to a neighborhood with like huge houses mm -hmm. and just go knock on their door and be like, can hey, decide? can I just get a tour of your house? Like, I just want to <laughs> see what it's like inside of here. I want to see if you bought this house basically on credit and don't have any furniture in here or like if you really have it decorated nice if you're like rich rich or something oh my gosh these houses are so crazy all right guys update we just got to the restaurant and we're bruising we're bruising here and i don't and have lipstick so i'm a little self-conscious so <laughs> you don't have chipstick I don't have lipstick. Look, it's bruising so bad. You don't I have to tell you guys what just happened, but I'm gonna tell you when we're out of here. Um, this is a uh, heated. This is more my stuff. Wait, we wanted to say big up Sunset Deli. Mm. Free chip Friday. Big up every Friday. And they're nice. <laughs> and they're nice. Good morning. It's the next day, and I'm. Honestly, a little shook. My bruising kind of went away. This is the ugliest thing you guys are probably going to see today. But look, it was so much more bruised yesterday. You know what I looked like? Kevin. Is that his name from Spongebob that got stung by a jellyfish? Anyways, I have to tell you guys some shit that went down yesterday. Almost ruined my day. I ended up getting really drunk last night. So after I got my nails done, not what the fuck? 
am I still drunk? After I got my lips done at Laser Away, I was supposed to go to a lunch. Oh, okay, let me, this is just like, I'm still like heated over what happened. Remember I told you guys I wanted to tell you something? Okay, let me get into the story. Usually when you have followers on Instagram, local restaurants will hit you up and be like, hey, do you want to come in? We'll offer you like two lunches for a post or whatever. They want you to post at their restaurant. And I've done that a few times here. And I've done it before with this restaurant. And it was awesome. This restaurant offers you a bottle of champagne to just come have lunch and like, you know, it's totally worth it. It's fun. So I had previously been to this restaurant. I look really ugly. I'm trying to hide myself. I had previously been to this restaurant and had an amazing time there. So when they reached out to me again, I was like, heck yeah, let's fucking do it. Made my reservation for that day at 1230. And then the day before, the day before, I DM'd them and I said, hi, like, is it okay to move the reservation to 1.30 because I had gotten my lip appointment at 11.30 and I know I wouldn't have made it at 12, you know what I mean? So I reached out to them and they said, no problem, exclamation point. Where's my fucking phone? I said, hey, is it possible to change my reservation to 1.30 p.m.? No problem. So, so we drive all the way from the valley to West Hollywood, pay for parking, and walk up to this restaurant. We get there, and Martin goes up the stairs first, then I come up and I was like, hi, we had a reservation, and she's like, what's the name? And I was like, Kaylin, this bitch goes, oh, you're an hour and a half late. And I was like, no, we're not, my reservation's at 1.30. And she was like, no, it was at 12.30. And I was like, no, I DM'd and said, hey, can we change it to 1.30? And they said, no problem. She's like, oh, you DM'd? And I was like, yes, I'll show you the messages. And she was like, I mean, you could show me the messages, but it wouldn't make a difference. And I was like, I literally turned around, walked down the stairs and said, let's go. Sh this bitch was being so rude. And so we walked downstairs and I, I'm like shaking because I'm so angry because I wanted to go off on this First of all, this restaurant reached out to me to come make a post for you. And this is how you're treating me? I don't know if she didn't know like who I was that like I was invited there to post for the restaurant. But what pisses me off is the fact that she would talk to a regular customer like that. I, I can't. But anyways, we ended up going to a sandwich shop right next door, the Sunset. Whatever, we mentioned it earlier. They had really good sandwiches and free chips on Friday. So, yeah, I was really disappointed. I don't know why, but this healing process compared to my first time is so much easier. Like, I'm not in any pain right now. My bruising is really not even that bad, which is shocking because last night it started bruising up. And when I first got them done, my lips bruised up. They swelled up all crazy. And I don't know if it's because it's the second time I've gotten them done. But this healing process is much easier than the first. I really like my lips. And I love Laser Away. Everyone there is so nice and welcoming and like informative. And I recommend them if you're looking for any of the procedures that I've had. Definitely do your research before you do something. Get prices before you do something. Make sure it's something that you do want to do. This week i'm gonna be traveling so there's gonna be videos with my mom there's gonna be more videos with martin when he meets me in new york so make sure you guys have my notifications on so you don't miss a video also i'll link everything about laser way in the description so you guys can check them out and i will see you guys in my next video be nice to people